All right, so in this video, I'm going to solve the equation x times x plus 2 times x plus 4 times x plus 6 is equal to 9. So to solve this, I'm going to first start by reordering this. So I'm going to write this instead as x times x plus 6 at the start times x plus 2 times x plus 4 is equal to 9. And the, and the reason I'm doing this is because I'm going to multiply x with x plus 6 and x plus 2 with x plus 4. So x times x plus 6 is x squared plus 6x, and x plus 2 times x plus 4 is x squared plus 6x plus 8. Now, I'm going to be using u substitution. So I'm going to let the variable u equal to x squared plus 6x. So now I get u times u plus 8 is equal to 9. And this means that u squared plus 8u minus 9 is equal to 0. And if I factor this out, I get u plus 9 times u minus 1 is equal to 0, meaning u is equal to negative 9 and u is also equal to 1. Now, let's go back. We let u equal to x squared plus 6x. So this means that u is either equal to negative 9. So x squared plus 6x equals negative 9. And x squared plus 6x is also equal to 1. So I have two equations from this. x squared plus 6x plus 9 is equal to 0. And x squared plus 6x minus 1 is equal to 0. Now for both of these, I can factor them out. So for x squared plus 6, x plus 9 equals 0. I get x plus 3 squared is equal to 0. So x is equal to negative 3. This is one solution. And for x squared plus 6x minus 1 equals 0, I can use the quadratic formula for this. And the quadratic formula is negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So if I plug these values into the quadratic formula, I get x is equal to negative 3 plus or minus the square root of 10. See, so these are two more solutions to this equation.